I had to step away and, and grab grab this and then come back for dramatic uh, <laughs> dramaticness. Uh, I won't be wearing this today, sadly, because it doesn't fit over this, and I gotta hear my buddies, Star Wars HQ. Um, if you haven't checked them out, I mean, they've been around on YouTube even before me, making Star Wars videos, and now they stream on Facebook, so. Um, but I think they're, they're, hopefully, maybe one day, we'll come back to YouTube, that'd be cool. So, today we're gonna play some squadrons, just have some fun, and this is my fourth time playing, so there's still a lot to learn. Much to learn, young Padawan. How are you guys doing? What's going on with you? What's new? I lost me jetpack, says that one random mando. That's not good. What's up? What's up? What's going on? Alright, so they're doing their intro, and they've muted themselves, so... We're just waiting until they're done. Kind of disappointed you don't use VR for this game? Yeah... I guess. I heard it's really nice, but I have a quest too. It's sitting over there. Just um, it's hard to stream and, and do VR at the same time, you know. So, oh wait, YouTube added some interesting stuff. Interesting. Add a highlight video. What the heck? You can clip stuff now. Add stream marker. What does that mean? It's pretty neat. Oh well. Uh, I'm working on the new Vader comic All right, for you guys. so we got Star Wars Theory joining us. I don't know if you can hear me. Hello there, yes, I can hear you. <laughs> there he is. Excited, so hello man. everyone to Star Wars Theory. Excited too, man. Alright. This has gotta be fun. Oh wait, you're, the, you're, you're the leader. The squad leader, let's go. Let's go! Run leader reporting in, let's go! Alright, so I think we'll start off with... Let's do some dog fighting. Okay. Start there, then we'll go into fleet battles and... So on and so forth. You're level 21. Hey, I still have to finish the campaign. I haven't finished it yet. Well, let me tell you the ending. So this is what happens. No, I'm just kidding. You can tell me. I won't spoil it. The ending is amazing. Is it? No, man, I'm not going to oh, spoil okay. it. Yeah. All right. Oh, man, the ending is so good. Everyone in my community can vouch for that. How far are you in the campaign? I, like, I'm now, uh, I'm now the, the Imperials, I think. Right, oh, I'm, so you're switching back and forth. Oh, awesome. wait. I'm, I think I've finished the Imperial part. Now I'm on the... Rebellion side again, so I think. Switching. Yeah, it keeps going back and forth. Yeah, that's one thing that I love about the campaign is the uh, switching back and forth with it. Yeah, it's not just one. So cool. Yeah. So awesome. I want them to do either DLC or a sequel. Um, especially with the ending. Oh, I want to spoil. I want a DLC. I want a DLC cool for the Clone Wars. Oh yeah, man! Clone Wars DLC with like the Arc One Seventy. Yeah. It, uh, That'd be the coolest. What else? Oh yeah, in one Naboo Starfighter, becoming a Vulture droid. That'd be so freaking awesome. Buzz droid. I want to see a B wing too. B wing man. Well, it, there's just be like I mean, so. Where's much, a B wing? Imagine if you could just be Grievous in a ship. <laughs> I know that'd be so freaking awesome. Yeah. Especially in VR, you look down at your like four arms. Oh my god. <laughs> Have you done? You've done the VR in this, right? People. Oh yeah, VR and this is incredible. I, I mean, I bought the Oculus Quest 2 just for this game. Oh the really? Clarity, the clarity. It's awesome. All right, so I'm ready up. What uh, what Starfighter are you going with? I over think I'm there? going with the X-wing. I haven't really. I'm level eight, eight, so yeah. <laughs> I am debating between the X-wing and the A-wing. You know what? Actually, I'm going to go A-wing. Hmm. I want some speed. Yeah, I want the speed. Yeah, I want the speed. I need I need the speed. I got the need for speed. I don't have a good loadout though. What do you have for your A-wing? Standard engine? Um I believe I let, let's see. I changed There was one thing I did change. Let me see what it was. It was the uh I believe it would dealt with the acceleration. Mm. I ended up changing to the Fabrotech dampener hull. Which gives you 100% more uh, hostile lock-on time. I don't have that. And it only reduces your health by 10%, though, so the trade-off makes sense. Do you unlock that later? Definitely recommend that. Uh, you you can unlock that. I believe you can unlock it any time. I mean, all you need is one of those. Um, for the engine? Yeah. Yeah, so if you go to hall. No, 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 for the hall. Oh, for hall. So if you go to hall, uh, then oh, go to yeah. the very last one called Fabrotech Dampener Hall. Yeah, got it. 
To me, that one is very important. Super important. Cool. Okay. Yeah, I like the A-Wing. Nice and speedy. Oh, yeah. All right, let's roll. Speedy. Yeah, I don't, I don't have too much selected for the components yet, but... I've kept a basic. Mm -hmm. uh, I was getting too complicated with it, and then I just was like, you know what? I'm keeping it basic. Yeah, I did that with the Interceptor, and I found it was just kind of counterproductive. Like, it wasn't really doing anything. It was kind of... It was just making my hull yeah. too lame. Too thin. Yeah, I, I might switch back over to the X-Wing, because the one thing about the A-Wing and the Interceptors mm -hmm. is the uh, health. I think it's almost half of the X-Wing. Right. Uh, and the TIE Fighter. So, I mean, if you get hit, you're done, man. You're done. Yeah, that's what that's I found with the Interceptor. It's it's my favorite, but it just, <laughs> like, two hits and you're dead. Yep. I, I tried to use it in the uh, fleet battles mode, but I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. Okay. We'll see. We'll see. All right, let's get in here. All right, here we so go. Good on PC. Oh, it looks beautiful. I bet. Yeah. I, think it looks, I think it looks very similar on PS4. I played both. Really? Okay. Oh, yeah. Is that you, Darth Toos? It is me. Is that you? Dude, I forgot how to play. <laughs> Just use the force. Yeah, right. Yes. I, if I, so you're using the PS4 controller. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, I got you. Got you back. Oh, that's a kill. Man, I love the boost on this thing, so good. Enemy missile incoming. Butch. Yeah, I got a guy hot on my tail. I'm trying to get this guy right now. Okay. Get it down. And uh, let me know in the chat if you can hear Star Wars Theory okay. I know that the volume, I kind of did it quickly, so just let me know if I need to turn down the game volume or anything. But it should be good. I'm dead. No! <laughs> Avenge no! me! I will! Who killed you? Uh, something boy. I think for a boy. need to go after him. He's, He's number personal. one. He's number one? He's number one. Oh, we're going to change that. Yeah. Yeah, they're, they're kind of winning, but... <laughs> Let's do this wrong. Long, don't worry. Oh. It's okay. Just give me the Imperials. We'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you need to be on the dark side, man. I know. That's my thing. What up, Callista? Thing, what up, Caleb? You probably want Anakin ship in here. Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, I wonder if they'll ever do some hero ships. I think they're gonna do some DLC stuff. I really do. Oh, yeah. This game was very well received. Mm -hmm. Where are we at? Where are we at? Honestly, I wasn't sure about the whole first person cockpit view thing at first. Yeah. But I love it. Yeah, when the trailer came I out, I was it. like, eh, it's just like Battlefront 2. Yeah, I was worried. I was kind of like, eh, yeah. why did. You and then I played it and I'm like, you know what? This is actually really fun. Oh, yeah. I'm addicted to it. I just can't get these dudes, though. We gotta kill assist. Don't know if that really counts for anything. Come on, spin around! Damn. I am injured. I'm dying. Dude, our team is good. Where are you? Coming in. Um... I'm over here somewhere! <laughs> I don't know how you really tell, like, your teammates where you're at. <laughs> you can't select it? With like your uh, with the well, you, can, L2. you can you can select you can select uh, like the enemy that's on your tail. Are you using well, mouse done... and keyboard? Yeah, you guys are mouse no, and keyboard. No, no, no. Guys. I'm oh. using I'm actually using the uh, Xbox controller on a PC. Whoa, what's happened to you, <laughs> man? I well, I know I have switched over to like more console, but yeah. I'm still on the PC on this game because of the uh, the VR, man, the VR. Well, I remember when we were doing all the Battlefront stuff. You guys, you guys were on console. Or, yeah, you were on com controller, and then you switched to. Um, PC. Yeah. And uh, the it. main reason for that was because of uh, when we go to the events, you know, 99% of the events were played right. on the right. PC. Right, right, it was, yeah. So I had to start practicing on the PC. Uh oh, got a so guy on my tail, I think. Dual okay, drift. I'm going to try to. I'm trying to find you, man. I don't know I don't where you are. I'm going to figure out how to yeah. get you. got to do a little boost drift I here. I kind of disabled my. Um, one thing I did do was change my controls, and I don't have that ability to target allies, I don't think. Well, yeah, I do. Yes, I should. Actually, let me see. Alright, so we are respawning back in. I died. I died hard, man. Ah! 
<laughs> what happened? It didn't sound good. I died. I died. It's okay. It's gonna be all right here. You should be able to form up on me. Hopefully, I can get you to form up on me. Okay. Zero kills, two deaths. That's what I like to see. Hey Theory, hey Ryan and or Robbie, it's Nick from Canada. Hope you brothers are good and nice subbies you guys got. Theory, loving the content. Thank you, Nick. Okay, here we go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Had to say hi to everybody real quick. Shut up, Siri. Go, 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 go. I'm boosting. I love that boost, man. Oh man, the boost is so good. I actually remapped the boost to the uh, L trigger. Oh, really? Yeah, it's so much better because when you drift, you know, on the uh, L stick, I believe you have it on your L stick. Yeah, it's I do. awkward, super awkward when you boot, when you try to do the drift maneuver. Missile coming at me. <laughs> I, I was like doing all these weird uh -oh. like, rolls. <laughs> I oh, died. God. You're awesome. Looking forward to shards of the past too, my friend. You with great work, sir. Thank you, Jordan. Oh yeah, same here, man. Yeah, me too. Absolutely cannot wait for it. It's gonna be amazing. Hey, I'm still working on the script, but it's it's um pretty much done. I sent it to the composer two nights ago. Even though oh, it's like sweet. Two years out, yeah. So oh, he awesome. can. Yeah, the music, the music um as well. It's like insane. Yeah. Oh, is that an actual orchestra that's being uh, um, composed? No, but that, for this um... next one, we we might actually have that. So. Okay, well, I mean, it sounds like it. Like, I couldn't even tell the difference. No, oh, thanks. Yeah. Yeah, hey, the oh, first one was Jake and Cadmus, very talented. And then the oh, yeah. part two and three will be Samuel Kim. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, it's going to be great. Very, very cool. Yeah, I love the music in it. Like, that's the one, you know, all of it's good, of course, but that's like... The music, to me, is one of the most difficult Not things to get up. right when you're making a fan film. I've never made a fan film, but... I agree. You gotta get that part right. I did. I did do Battle for Two Conflicts, you know, but I didn't hire like an actual composer for it. Right. Yeah, music is. I think like I would say at least fifty percent of it. Oh yeah, you gotta nail the music, especially when it comes to Star Wars stuff. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's just so iconic. <laughs> it's everything. Everything, man. It's too bad. Do you have your music on in the game, by the way? I, I do. Shut yeah. Off. Oh, you have your shot. I shut off as a fear for copyright. Um, oh, I know. don't even care anymore. <laughs> you don't even care anymore. <laughs> I don't even, like, whatever. I want to turn it back on. I might turn it back on. Yeah, I, think, I played this for five or six hours, and I got it got copyrighted for like two seconds, and oh, uh, or, yeah. yeah, it was like eight seconds, and then yeah, they That's took tough. the video. Yeah. They need a way to like whitelist all gamers from the you know playing in the video games. Yeah. Well, they got to make their money. Well, no, they should, they should whitelist. Yeah, they should. <laughs> I do understand why they do that. Yeah. Okay, it is 28 to 13. The Imperials are definitely Woo, giving us a run oh, for I our money. Oh, fudge. I ran right to that guy. Fudge biscuits. Where is this guy? Where is this guy? He's hot on my tail. <laughs> ah, there he is. Uh, okay. okay, so uh, I'll try to spawn. I wish there was an option where you could spawn in right on your yeah, squad. Yeah, that'd, cool. that'd be cool. Have you played the new uh, Cold, Cold War? Out. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. Dude. Like, me and Mike, we play Cold War all the time. Did we win? So if you ever want no to play that, me. let me know. I know that the, uh, I do the beta I'll is now tonight. live for... Oh, okay, you're playing that tonight? Yeah, I'm awesome. going to play tonight, yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah, I'm planning on playing tonight as well, so... Everyone squad up, let me know. Let's do it. Let's do it, man. I think my buddy's doing a 24-hour stream today, so... Oh, really? <laughs> Have you ever done a 24-hour stream yourself? No, the most I did was nine hours for Jedi Fallen Order. At once. I want oh, one. Yeah, yeah I've done, I think the most I've done, probably around eight or nine hours, and... You know, my community, they've asked for like a 24-hour stream, but I'm like, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't know, know if I'd survive that. I don't know, dude. I'll probably die by the end of it. I probably sleep for like eight of it. <laughs> <laughs> then it wouldn't be. Yeah, you I know. Be I'd have to take a break. Stream. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'd have well, to have like pizza breaks in the middle or something. Dude, that's what I did for for like, the Fallen Order when I ordered pizza and I was eating it on stream. Yeah, pizza and, party. Yeah, it was fun. It's a party. It was good. It's a good time. 
Yep. And uh, this month, I plan on doing the Halloween party stream where I'm planning on opening different snacks and candy at the top of the hour oh, cool. with everybody. Cool. So I think that'll be fun. I gotta link your um your Facebook page, so send it to me when we're done. Oh, okay, awesome. Yeah. Oh, yeah, absolutely, dude. Gotta say though, Not YouTube misses now. you. I miss seeing you guys pop up. I know, man. I know I miss it too. It's good to be playing with you. It is. Definitely is good to be playing again. Having some fun, chilling, some squadrons. I hope that the next game we get is either a uh what do you call it pod racer game oh my god could you imagine oh god that'd be incredible pod racer game or a bounty hunter open world game you wow. know that's based like on the mandalorian yeah that's what i that's what i really want to see i love that what do you think the next game is gonna be well it's interesting because i've actually seen like um the guy who's in charge of Forza Motorsport, right? The design right. director. Right. Um, and, and they also do Forza Horizon, which are my two favorite racing games. Guess what he has been tweeting out relentlessly? What? His old pod racer uh, models. Wow. I didn't realize that he had made um, the original pod racer. I had no idea. Wait, he, he made that game? Star Wars yes. Racer? He made the original pod racing game. Oh, wow. What the heck? And uh, the turn 10... Uh, design director has been posting tons of like pod racing images. He's like, hey, what do you think about this? What's, the, this what's is, his uh, name? I gotta, I gotta follow. His him. name is. I actually just recently discovered his Twitter. So his name. It's John. Let me get. Let me get that exact name for you. Because honestly, I didn't know. I I had no idea that he worked on pod racers. Like what? Yeah. John Knowles. John Knowles. Yeah, John Knowles. I want to get the exact name for you and. The stuff he's been tweeting out is incredible. Let me tell you, he's been tweeting out like Anakin's uh, pod racer, you know, bringing it back to life. There's like a million kind of John like Knowles. Which, which one is it? It's it's J J O N K N O L E S. It's uh, at J O N K one nine six nine. Hmm. <laughs> Hopefully, you can find him. Yeah, um... He's on there. He's the one of all the pod racing stuff going on right now. I've been tweeting to him like, Dude, please make a pod racing game. 1969? John Knowles, 1969? Yes. Yep. No results. You'll see it. No results on it? I could send you that one here. I could send it to your... Okay. You should be able to send it to your uh, Twitter. Let me see if I can find it again. I'll send you the exact tweet, actually. Sure, yeah. Okay, I just sent it to your Twitter. You'll see. You'll see. <laughs> Oh man, it's incredible. John Knowles. Hello, Araceli, how's it going? What's happening? Following. Following him now. Dude, this is so cool. Alec, what's up? Made many Star Wars That's games, amazing. LucasArts from 90 to 04. Jesus. Oh yeah. Oh my god, attempt number yeah. two test render cinematic model of Anakin's pod racer I made for the PC and Sega Dreamcast versions of Star Wars Episode 1 Racer. Using 3D Studio. Oh, yeah. Wow. Guys, check this out. It's incredible. Yeah, your community probably go nuts seeing that. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's, it's, I went nuts seeing. I was like, oh my god, and he's posted like probably ten images on his Twitter. Jeez, what the yeah, heck? Yeah, go through his Twitter. You'll see like all this concept art, all these level designs. Um, it looks incredible. He also posted a, a, a skin for Forza Horizon Four that they made. I was like, what? Wow. It's like their handling model, like if you've ever played Forza Horizon 4, their handling system for their cars is the best. Like yeah. If they ever made a pod racing yeah. game, it would be insane. Forza just feels really good. Oh ha! man, I love Forza. What the heck? There's the Anakin mod in Forza that he made, I think. Yeah. Yep. That's neat. Hit that like button, everyone, if you want to see a new pod racing game. I'd want to um, see like customization. Um, Dude, that game would be amazing. Oh, oh god! My gosh. Like if they brought it to modern day. He's been posting all so much about this. Yeah, it's weird. I'm, I'm like, why is he all of a sudden? Oh my god, he's got this? team toes. Yeah, he's got it all. <laughs> I was like, wow. Yeah, when you see it, you're like, holy crap. 
It's really cool. Oh god, it's amazing. Someday, man. I, I would want to see like VR support, full VR support, and then also you know, the yeah. ability to switch between first person, third person view in it. I want to so see cool. um I'd say like an open world force user game where you can be either a Jedi, um Sith or Mandalorian or whatever you want to be, like a bounty hunter. Um, oh my god! Basically, just yeah, Knights of the Old Republic, I guess. But, yeah, that'd but, be awesome. But you know, an Unreal Engine like remastered. Yeah, I think. It would be oh, really I would good. love to see that. Yeah. Absolutely. When do you think we're gonna, we're gonna get um, the new Fallen Order? Jedi Fallen Order two. I would not be surprised if they're gonna try to push for that one next year, late next year. But again, with the whole pandemic, it could be pushed back to like you know. 2022, but right. I would be surprised they're going to try to push for it for yeah. 2021 and then maybe do DLC, you know, as, I don't know, extra missions or something. Yeah, maybe. I hope we get it next year. I would love to see that next year. That'd be great. Oh, man. That'd be awesome. Would be amazing. This is my favorite game, I think. Oh, yeah. Jedi Fallen Order is definitely one of my favorite Star Wars games ever. I wouldn't be surprised if they're going to do some multiplayer in it, too. Oh my god, could you imagine? Ah! Oh god, it'd be nuts. Because my guess is, I don't know if this is true, but my guess is like with Battlefront, you know? I do wonder if someone's thinking that that game is too big of a game, and they're trying to kind of separate it into multiple games, you mm -hmm. know? Mm -hmm. So you know how Battlefront 2 had like, um, Heroes vs. Villains in it? Yeah. The new HVV, I wouldn't be surprised uh, if it's within Jedi Fallen Order. Pretty neat. I liked 2015's Battlefront more than the second one, I think. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't know why. Really? It just, yeah, I'm not sure why. Did That's you? interesting. Well, there, there's more definitely for Battlefront it's 2. It's tough. But I, I like I the fun factor in 2015, but I also like the ability to create classes in, like, Battlefront 2. I just think they need to go back to the originals. Like, go back to the originals. You know, stick with standard conquest mode. Because, for me, like, I start falling in love with Star Wars with Battlefront. Like, it was before the movies. Yeah. For yeah. everything. So I think they should go just back to the originals. Yeah. In my humble opinion. That's what I liked about it, too. Oh, yeah. I just love the ability to capture, like, objectives in it. Just keep it simple. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know how to fly. Jesus, I just killed myself. It's gonna be okay, it's gonna be okay. Just use the cover. Use the cover. Right now I'm trying to follow this bomber and um he's being a pain in the butt. At least some consistent zero kills, two deaths. I think it's good. Yes, consistency is key. <laughs> as long as you're consistent. Oh jeez, I just killed myself, I've run into something. Help! Help me! Dude, am I in an X-Wing? Dark Tooth. the hell? This feels so I slow. I... think you are in... I... No, I'm in an A-Wing. Never mind. Um... Which I'm using A-Wing as well. I like to switch between the A-Wing and the X-Wing. Yep. Everyone vote in the chat. What is your favorite Starfighter in Star Wars Blockers? I would love to see a Disney Plus Dude, what Did the... you see that, that uh, Star Wars Squadron short they made? Yeah, the, that was really uh, cool. The animated one? That yeah. was amazing. It was really great. Dude, like, I would love to see, like, a whole Disney Disney Plus series dedicated to, um, pilots. Yeah, an Imperial pilot. Oh my god. That'd be cool. <laughs> You're like, it has to be Imperial. Well, I just feel like they just <laughs> do so much stuff. Remember, like, with Battlefront 2, they were really pushing the, uh, the whole agenda with... <laughs> Uh, it's, it's all about the Imperials, like you get to see the side of the Imperials, and and then yep. she just switches. Yeah, yeah, that was the biggest complaint about that game, yeah. and um, I, I felt the exact same way. I was like, what? She's switching over already? Yeah. They tease this whole thing, and what? Yeah. Like, they should have had that for the very end. Right. Personally, that's what I think, it maybe, like, branched off into, like, her rebel story. 
in another game or sequel. There's a guy on you. Um, There's a guy on you. Oh god. I'm gonna try and get him. Help me. Uh oh, someone's locking on me now. Yeah, they're trying to kill us. Shoot it. They're trying to kill me good. Brandon says tie interceptor, X wing, and a wing. Good choices, good choices. Ooh! Spin them around! Fire. My glass on my cockpit is completely cracked. Your mind's got some chips in it. I am dying here. However, my poor bobblehead head is still intact. It's good news. Oh, careful. I haven't been able to show off my Vader bobblehead yet. <laughs> you gotta get it, man. You gotta get it. I have it. We just haven't played Imperial. Oh, that's right. Duh. Yeah, I've been playing more on the... Uh, it's weird. I've been playing more on the Republic side than the Imperials lately. I don't know why that is. Really? I can go in there and have Maybe it, you like it more. choose Imperial. Yeah. Oh, oh, just randomly it just does that, eh? Yeah, I've been choosing random faction, but I can have it choose Imperial next time. <gasps> I know, Marie. I will never leave our wingman. Who the heck is this guy? I'm trying to keep track of where he's at. I don't know where they're at. I need to find a way to ping where Star Wars Theory is easier. Yeah, I'm not doing too well over here. <laughs> <laughs> it's all fun, man. It's all good. We're just having fun. Yeah. It would be cool if they uh, also like had like a co-op mode. For a campaign? Yeah, that'd be neat. Yeah, for campaign or just like a co-op mode where you can go up and like face off against, you know, Star Destroyers or flagships. Come on, get him! No! Alright, we are refreshing our systems. Over. Systems refreshed over. 13. <laughs> if he doesn't kill me, I'm gonna kill myself. Porkins! Man, I don't know what the hell is with my mobility. It's just so. Yikes. You gotta use that boost. You gotta use that boost. I've yeah. all power to your engines. Yeah. Do it. I didn't use the drift in this game for so long, the drifting mechanic, but man, it's everything. It's like a lifesaver, yeah. Mechanic, oh my god. I'm not sure I have the hang of it yet. Yeah, I didn't have the hang of it until I remapped it off of that um, left stick. Oh, really? Oh. oh, yeah. Like, the left stick, it's so awkward. I, I can't, I couldn't figure out how to drift. Oh, I, I kept on seeing all these people drifting. I was like, what are, what are they doing? How are they doing it? We are live in Star Wars Squadron. Mike says, looking to forward to the survive. Mandalorian footage during Monday Night Football. Oh, yeah. I heard about that. Oh, boy. Do you think... What do you think we're going to see? Yeah, do you think we'll see new characters? I think so. I think we'll get a Ahsoka you snippet. You do? Yeah. Oh, boy. It's two weeks out, man. Not even. So I think, you know, people are just oh, going to... Yeah, they're, they're going to go all out. Because I know with Baby Yoda, of course, they were originally going to show him in the, uh, you know, Season 1 trailers. But they decided against that, so I wonder if they're going to do the same thing with the uh, Mandalorian Season 2. Yeah. What do you prefer? Do you prefer they show, like, uh, Soka in the trailer, or do you want them no, to... No, I don't want to show her. I, I don't want them to show her. I just want to, sh I want to see, like, maybe a hint. Okay, that would be cool. That would be cool. Like, how how would you think it? I don't know, maybe, you know, show... You could show one of her lightsabers, or you could show um, her staff, or you could show her robe, or, like... That would be cool. Something, just something super simple. I like that idea, yeah, that's the way they should do it. Because if they showed her, like, her face, I'd be like, oh man, they should have waited! Yeah. Because I, I want to see that moment during an episode. That moment needs to be, yeah, it needs to be hidden like Baby Yoda was. 
Oh yeah, absolutely. I want it to be like a complete surprise moment because absolutely. I don't even know how they kept Baby Yoda secret. I don't know. Yeah, they did a good job with that. That was amazing. Yeah, the world went crazy. Oh yeah, like when I saw that part, I was like, oh my god. For me personally, like the Baby Yoda moment, it's one of my all-time favorite Star Wars moments. Like for real. Yeah, I remember when that happened. Oh, yeah, I was I like, that moment. what? Yeah. You remember the whole craze with the internet after that? Dude, yeah. It was never oh, the same. Yeah. It was never the same. I know. I know. It was like, what is happening? Yeah. And I watched it first. I ended up watching it first before my bros, right? Yeah. Saw that part. And then, you know, told my bros, you guys need to watch this immediately with me before you get it spoiled. Yeah. Like, you have no idea what's in episode one. They're like, oh, okay, we'll watch it. And then I watched with my bro Robbie and his expression on his face. It's priceless. Like the expression on people's faces, you know, when they see Baby Yoda for the first yeah. time. Price, priceless. I'm definitely going to do a watch party for all of the episodes. Oh, that'd be cool. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. I've already rewatched season one. So good. It, it was better rewatching it the second time than the first time. It is better the second why, time. Yeah. I, I think because you know, you notice more, you know more, you can, you have time to think about things. Yeah, exactly. Versus, I feel like also when you watch it the first time, your mind is overly critical yeah. about everything. Yeah, like sure. you're just like, this had better be perfect, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and then the second time you watch it, you're just like kind of sitting back more enjoying it, taking it in. Right. And I was like, man, this is so much better than I remember. It was really, really good the first time. But the second time I was like, oh, my God. Yeah. It was incredible. Yeah. They did a I really good it. job with it. It just goes oh, to yeah. show what you get when you put Filoni and Favreau together. Oh, absolutely. Holy green. Like, everything they touch, man, turns, turns to gold. It does, yeah. They need to put them in charge really of more does. projects, I think. Oh, yeah. I know that uh, Watiti, he's making movies, or a movie. Um, but I believe Dave Filoni and John Favreau, I wouldn't be surprised if they're more focused on the series for now. Probably. Um, but I did hear from Variety, I don't know if you saw that article on Variety. No. Uh, where... John Favreau, I believe, said that he's interested in making a uh, Mandalorian movie. So, hmm. well, I don't know how I feel about that. Um, we already have the show, so I mean... Yeah, we already have the show. Maybe so, after I, the I show? Know, like, I, I, yeah, I, I don't know I, what, what his plan would be. I don't, I don't know, man. I'm sure once yeah, you get a hotel, Galactic you have better Empire. control experience for sure. Love the content. Hi, Ryan. Big fan as well. Uh, try this in VR if you can. Thanks, Scroll Tech. I, I'm I'm garbage at this game. I mean, it's it's only my fourth time playing, <laughs> so how good could I be? But yeah, I mean, are you playing with yeah, the? Just play for fun. Are you playing? You're playing with a controller, right? I actually play with the controller. I thought about getting that Hotas set up. Yeah. Um, I just I've never I've never messed with a flight stick before. Mm -hmm. I, I know that some people mess with a flight stick, but I've seen technical difficulties with it too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I know Josh. Which is another reason why I didn't waste my time on it. I'm like, I'll wait for them to like iron out all that stuff. Yeah, I like the controller. I'm playing with a PS4 controller. Yeah. Oh yeah, PS4 controller is awesome. The PS5 controller <laughs> is gonna be insane. Dude, I still have yet to get mine. Oh, Do you man. think they're gonna release more in help November? Or... I'll try. Oh, thanks, dude. Um, do, oh yeah, I think they'll get uh, before November. I wouldn't be surprised if there's one more wave. But mm. that one wave will be very difficult to get, of course. I bet, yeah. Uh, I would not be a bit surprised, but, uh, you know, like a month or two after release, I'm going to guess they're going to be hopefully yeah. readily available on the shelves. Yeah. We'll see. Damn. We'll see. That sucks. Oh, well. At least yeah, did I got you try a good to order PC. it through like a store or did you try to order I did. it direct through? Yeah, Sony? so I, I put my name on uh, at EB Games, uh, which is owned by GameStop. I think I. I put my name on a pre-order pre-order list <laughs> so it's like once oh, they get notification yeah. of a pre-order uh they'll call all the yep. people on that list and then they, they just drop them and then they just yeah they never called me and i was like so do i get dibs on it and they're like no we're all nope. sold out i'm like what okay wow you're just like thanks a lot i was like thanks a lot yep <laughs> thanks for nothing not going to you guys ever again <laughs> it used to be called eb games over here Really? In the U.S. I do. I do remember uh, when I was super young, I would go to EB Games. Yeah. I'm like EB Games. I want to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now it's GameStop over there, right? Younger. Yeah. It, it's same yeah, same company. So. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Do you remember that? Yeah. 
Yeah, but I don't know. I've been going to them since I was a little kid, so it's just stuff like that that bugs oh, yeah. me. It's like, oh man. Yeah, I mean, What's if you're point on, of a, having if you're on a, list? a call list, yeah. they should at least call you first. Mm -hmm. I don't, did they even try, did they tell no. you were at, like at the bottom of the list no, or something? No, no, they never called anyone. They didn't call anyone. Mm -hmm. Well, that's, I, I don't understand why they would do that. That's not cool. Yeah, me neither. Unbelievable. Oh well. Have you talked to Massive G at all recently? Uh, I have not. Well, actually, in the uh, in the squadron event, I mean, I didn't get to talk to him that much, but I did see him in the squadron event. Played with him a little bit. Try not to die. Where we at? I may have shot him down a couple times, and he did the same to me. <laughs> Jeez, I just died by going out of bounds. <laughs> oh God, where are we at? No! I died already. Me too. KB Toys. Brand says KB Toys. I've actually never been there. Here oh. I come. What bobble do you have in your tie? In my tie, I do not have one. I have failed. I kind of failed at uh, customizing my tie fighter. Oh jeez, what the heck. Dude, I... This Interceptor, man. Better. I die in like two seconds. Yeah, the Interceptor, what... You know, on this map, like the, the maps with the large debris fields, mm -hmm. um, the TIE Bomber with the auto rotary cannon mm -hmm. is actually super good. I might actually switch to that here just a second, because... The thing is, like, these competing uh, X-Wings and A-Wings, -wing. they can't get yeah. up to speed. Oh, okay, can't yeah. get up to speed in this map. I might switch over to that one, actually. Give the world. Thanks, Lewis. Okay. Ooh. Homelander playing in. as Thrawn would be really cool. Homelander playing as Thrawn would be awesome. Yeah, the actor, Anthony Stark. That'd be really oh, yeah. sweet. Be I cool. could see that. Did you watch all of season two? Oh, yeah. It was good. I think season one was better, in my opinion, but. Season, season one was, was better, good. but season two finale, yeah. you know, was. It was oh, yeah. Killed it. <laughs> Literally. Yep. <laughs> Do you think she's coming back? I think so. Yeah, I think so too. I'm really I'm scared. He said yeah, that I'm she's scared. being hold, held in an undisclosed location, so she's probably just regenerating really? or something. Yeah. Oh god, I didn't. Did they say that in the series? Yeah, yeah, like... yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. remember that part. Yeah, oh. at the end. Where I was in shock. Were... I was kind of like in shock mode after that. She looked that. like Anakin. Like, oh my god. Yeah. Oh, she did. Yeah. She did. And I think she was speaking like German or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, that's so creepy, man. Oh, that was uh, quite the finale. Get him! Careful. I just miss all of the antics they did with uh, the Deep from season one. Dude, I mean, the scene with Deep the is like, he steals the show, I think. <laughs> I know, so they should have done a little bit more with like the dolphins and stuff. Almost. Or like where he's joking around with the creatures. Yeah. It's like, that's what, that's what was missing from season two because when you get to the end of it you're like man they didn't hardly do anything like with the uh, comedic elements of the beat uh Bram says boy season three is likely to shoot next year awesome i want it to shoot sooner than that everything's so delayed and then we got obi-wan shooting in march oh is obi-wan shooting in march oh mm. awesome oh man it's gonna be awesome do you think it's gonna be uh, really good, or what do you think? I think so. I think they uh -oh. know this is like a Ready to do it's this. the biggest show for them. So, oh yeah. I mean, like, Mandalorian's got nothing compared to the Obi Wan show. Yep. So they need to really nail this one. I can't screw it up. Nah. <laughs> I definitely can't screw it up. Like, I, I don't know. Man, I wonder how they're going to make it action pack. That's the thing. For me, like, Wait, I want it to be like a meaningful story, of course, but I want it to have a lot of action. Same, yeah. I don't want it to be supposedly boring, like the original stuff. script for it was just gonna have Kenobi in the very last episode, and it was like about it was about some like woman or something. Hmm. Need lightsaber battles. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh, uh -oh. oh god! 
I am dying in this one. Our team is dying big time. Jesus, what the hell is going God, on? God, I ran to the rock. I don't think I've ever been so bad at a game before. <laughs> it's tough, I'm telling you. It's tough. It's a, <laughs> it, it's a tough one. I yeah, mean, yeah, yeah. you gotta, I don't know, man. It's like, I would like to see, it would be cool to see, like, the ability to do, like, rage or something, or mm. some co op. Mm -hmm. Or another yeah, game that I really want to see is a new Republic Commando. Yeah, we were I want about respawn that. entertainment yeah. to make Re Republic Commando. Yeah. Anyone in the chat want to see that? Post in the chat if you want to see a brand new Republic Commando. Oh, man, they're killing me. God, this team's just tough, though. I think they're really coordinated or something. Shoot. Uh, Shoot. Chris, what's up? Nick, what's happening? Hello, hello. Hope you're all doing good. Adam, take it easy, dude. See you later. By the false Oh. Here, I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to swing around the top area. Jesus, six deaths. Zero kills. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> it's either the asteroids are going to get you or the enemy. <laughs> Back in the fight. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. Try to take one of these dudes down. Dang it, I couldn't even take them down at the end. Interrupting me. The new Republic has prevailed. Uh, you said you wanted to play as the Imperials, so. Uh... Yeah, not doing well anymore. No, oh, well. I think it did worse as Imperials. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. That was tough. Yeah. That team was definitely tough. I mean, look at the scoreboard. I mean, come on. Every now and then you'll, you'll face a team that's like ridiculous. All right, so we will go into another round. We could do some fleet battles too. Um, that's that's tough as well. I'm not sure which mode is tougher, dog fighting or fleet battle. I think fleet battle is actually tougher. Is it? Yeah, because I mean you're going up against, you know, the raider. Yeah. You're going up against the the capital ships, flagships. Dealing with dog fighting all at once. We could try it though. Sure. Well, let's try that. Let's go and mix it up. Uh, uh, let's see. Got a fleet battles. Kevin Here says try go. spinning. That's a good trick. I will. <laughs> spinning always works. If you put your uh, power, all of your power, you know, how you divert power, yeah. to your engines. Mm -hmm. And then pull back your throttle exactly halfway until you hear that little ping noise. Okay. You'll be able to avoid missiles. Hmm. So there's two steps to that. You gotta divert all power to your engines and then pull back back throttle halfway. What that does is it makes your uh, maneuverability double. Oh, interesting. And then you can avoid missiles, so. So technical. Just a little tip. Thank you, Commander. What's that? Thank you, Commander. <laughs> Ed, here we go. I got my max acceleration. Uh, uh, I'm gonna go Tie Fighter on this one. You're going Tie? Okay. I'm gonna go Interceptor a more well again. Balanced. I just, I, I don't know. I, even though it, it dies in like two seconds because the hull, I just, I like going fast. Oh yeah, yeah. I like going fast. You can, you can catch up to the enemies, sneak up on them, mm -hmm. and then you could also get away from them quick. Yep. But in this mode, I haven't really had a lot of success with the, the Interceptor. Because I die so quickly. I don't have success either way, so might as well have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> no. Might as well. Might as well be in the Starfighter you love. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, why not? You think we're going to see Boba and Mando? I I know there's theories that uh, Timothy Oliphant yeah. is going to play either Boba or the guy who is wearing Boba's outfit, I believe. I yeah. think that's a rumor. Yeah. Um, I think it would be the latter where he's wearing Boba's armor. Because mm -hmm. I think in the trailer, I think someone spotted what might be Boba Fett's armor mm -hmm. on the back of that speeder. Right, yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, so I don't know. God, I don't know. What do you think? Do you think Boba? I think we'll see him. Yeah, I think we'll see him. I think we might see Rex. Um, Rex would be oh, cool, God, but I mean, nice. he's super old oh, now because of the accelerated aging. So, unless they oh, stopped yeah, wouldn't it, he'd be like eighty. Yeah. How old would he be? He'd be super old. He'd be old. old, man. Yeah. I don't want to see Rex like that. <laughs> I don't want to see him all old. But he might have stopped what it somehow. That? I don't know if you if you can do that. Slow down your aging. That would be cool. Use that uh, compound V from the boys. <laughs> Rebels is doing great, man. Yeah, I'm loving it so far. I'm almost done. I'm on. I'm like, oh man, Rebels gets good. Yeah, at the end. dude, it was such a grind. Season one and two. Um, there I were like agree, yeah. maybe like season two episodes, two. three episodes that were actually important, but the rest were just like very boring to me. Yeah, it's like they had filler episodes. Like, there was episodes where they're like, let's go fetch some... Uh, yeah, I, I hate the word filler, you know, but like, they, they were legitimately, like, filler they episodes. Were. And I was like, what is this, dude? It's like things oh, yeah, are so I'm irrelevant that you just don't even need to know about. Yeah, some episodes felt like, you know, a video game fetch quest mission. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, Which I get you I have to have that, mission? but it was like two seasons of that almost. And with little, know, little I, glimmers of... I want to get the... I think they should get to the point where they have zero filler episodes because if you look at like a series like Breaking Bad, yeah, um, even though it had that fly episode, mm -hmm. I don't know if you remember the fly episode, but mm -hmm. um, it has zero filler episodes. Like every episode, I'm I'm rewatching Breaking Bad right now. Every single episode pushes the for the the story forward. I agree. Yeah, it does. It's so good. Yeah, like, the fly episode. Every is episode stupid. is so good. Yeah. Yeah. I just don't want to see. I don't want to see any filler episodes. I think at this point, you know, people want to get past that, and they want they want a really good quality show. Yeah. That's what we need. I agree. That's what we demand. We should get Lore Master next time. Yeah, we should. We need it. Lore Master. Yeah, he's got some good stuff. Did you play Valhalla yet? Valley, thank you. Ah, uh, my bro Robbie's played. Um, mm. Hall. I I have not played it yet. That looks amazing. It looks good. Oh yeah. And I know that they confirmed the 60 frames per second on the next gen console, so that one. It's gonna be gonna almost like beautiful. PC, I guess. Oh like yeah. Like a real good PC. I can't wait for that. One. I mean, it's Vikings. Yeah. Vikings all the way. Here we go. Oh god, this map. There's no cover. We're screwed! What are we? Get him! Get him good! I'm dead. It looks like he has blocked my missile. God, I gotta turn around. Oh god! Has been the face hugger Marie <laughs> from, from Aliens? <laughs> Oh wait, I can't. I can't. Oh, okay, I can repeat. Ready to There you go. Swing around over. Nice head right for me. Oh, we got him. Where are they? Where are they at? Oh, there they are. So who do you think that one character is in Mandalorian? The, the character that's played by... Is it Sasha? Sasha... Sasha Banks. Yeah, Sasha Banks. people are saying it's Sabine like, Wren. Really? Yeah, I can really? see that. I can see that. I, f I feel like maybe it is because they even photoshopped her hair or something in the trailer. Really? Yeah, if Did you they zoom really? in, yeah, it looks very photoshopped. Like, the hair is coming outside of the hood, and it's just like, what? What's going on? Oh. I think they kind of did like a Infinity War Trigger. Hulk kind of thing. Oh, did they really? Yeah, maybe. Interesting. Interesting indeed. That'd be cool. Yeah. That'd be very cool to see. They, like, took away her colored hair, possibly. Who knows? Hmm. Yeah, I wonder if she'll be, like, painting. <laughs> yeah. She's too artsy. <laughs> yeah. What's up, Roy? Thank you so much. Oh, God. This one coming. Help me. Help me! Happy birthday, Anthony! You just turned 21 today? Awesome. 
know what that means. Time to get the beer. What is the legal drinking age over there where you're at? Uh, I think it's 19. Is it? Yeah. So we gotta wait two more years. Here in America. Yeah. Cool, man. Okay, we're defending cruisers. They are attacking them. Trying to take these dudes out. Nice goal. God, who's hitting me? Go, 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 go! Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. Firing. That was close. Uh oh. Spirit oh. keeps on targeting AI. I don't want to target AI. Ah. Oh. Nicholas, what's happening? Kellen, what's up? How's it going? Hello, hello. Hope you're all doing well. Welcome to the stream. We are playing with Star Wars Theory. I'm sure you've heard of him. Dead. He has a massive YouTube channel, and uh, we're having fun in Star Wars Squadrons, trying to survive. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh God! <laughs> oh man! I'm telling you, this mode is—I I swear, this mode's tougher than. Um, We've destroyed enough fighters. Dog fighting. Falling back. Oh god. They wing down. Over. Enemy frigates in range. I'm Just heading towards the frigates. Over. Isn't it a frigate? A breakfast food? Ah. Careful. They got a lock on me. Missile coming my way. I feel like my lasers overheat too quickly sometimes. I can't figure out why. Because they're hot. They're hot, man. I'm firing them too much. I'm inverted right now. Oh, God. That's the thing about uh, space. You never know when you're really inverting. That's true. Or people can't hear you scream. <laughs> Yeah, it's true. Like, all of the sounds in Star Wars and Space would never exist. I know. I don't know how we're hearing But it them. would be so lame. Could you imagine all of those fight scenes without any sound? That would be weird. Like, I know that I did. Completely. That'd be so strange. I know that uh, Battlestar Galactica does a lot of their scenes kind of more quiet, I believe. Like, the one series did it where they're, like, a little bit more quiet. More realistic, yeah. And realistic, and it's kind of creepy. It's kind of creepy, man. Lock like, that on, one scene with on. the, uh... Dude, why are my missiles Blade firing? Horn? I don't understand. That's up to you, Slave Horn. Where you released that, uh... What was that thing called, that... Oh, man. It was called, like, a sound bomb. Oh, well, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Which one? What are you talking about? The, the one where, uh... The Slave One's chasing Obi-Wan in Episode 2. And they start oh, dropping yeah, those yeah, seismic yeah, yeah. charges. The yeah. seismic charges, that's right. And when, before the seismic charge goes off, it's completely quiet, so, and then it just makes oh, it loud. Oh, it's amazing, boom. yeah. So awesome. Completely muted. That scene. And then just... Oh, yeah. Psh, yeah. <laughs> it's a good imitation of it. Thanks. Oh, God! I died! Died hard. Died real hard. I love the sounds of the TIE Fighters. They're so cool. Oh, yeah. The elephants. Yeah, the really Didn't they mix like elephants with like car screeching or something? Like something like that. Yeah. That's so weird. The question is, how did they get those elephants to sound like that? <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. What did they have to do? That's all. We're moving on. Looks like we have to destroy one more frigate. We're actually doing pretty good in this one. You're doing real good. What the heck? Ah, okay, they're coming back, are <laughs> Star Wars Theory, no! Avenge There's me. too many of them! I will. Oh, I will. Do it. 
on radiant. I'm actually man. using the bomber. Are you guys gonna be making more lore videos? Yes. Like I'm trying to get a schedule where I'm doing more lore videos, stuff like that. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you're streaming full time, right? Yeah, streaming full time. But I want to get it where I can maintain both the streaming and the videos. You know? Yeah, I know. It's tough. Yeah. But yeah, the answer is yes. I got some coming up for the Mandalorian, which will be fun. Good, yeah. Um, I want to do more fun videos too. Can we do some fan fictions? Yeah, fan fictions would be fun as well. Again, they just take so much time. I gotta get. I'm trying to get someone to edit for me and help me out, but we'll see. Yeah, they do. We'll take a long time. see. That's the goal. Now I'm angry. Cause I love doing that stuff. But I miss it. I miss it, man. It's great, man. I, I think fan fictions are the most fun to make. They are, but they're very time-consuming because you gotta you gotta think it all out and. It can be a lot of work, but it's fun. No, help! Help me! I died. No! I died hard! Uh... Bummer! Okay, so far we can do a lot of work. Did you guys meet uh, Tommy Wazoo at, at, uh... Oh, oh I, 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 went to, I went to Comic-Con at... Um, Did you? Are you, are you talking about the room? The room kind? Yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. I, I, um, he was he was at uh, LA Expo. Really? Yeah. I know. Like I, ne ago. I never. You act. Did you meet him? Did you meet him in person? Yeah, I got a picture with him. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Dude, he's such a character, man. It's such an interesting that human. It's hilarious. Yeah, I've seen some of his interviews. He's just a different he's thinker, so completely. He's like on another level. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That is so funny. What did you guys talk about? Did you guys talk about anything? We didn't really like talk much about it. Well, well, I was standing behind a girl who was getting a photo with him, and he didn't charge anything for a photo, which was so cool. Um, That's cool. Or no, he was like, he's like, wait, uh, I think you have to buy something if you want to take a photo with him. You have to buy, like, his merch or something like that. Oh, okay, I see. Um, but yeah, I was standing behind this girl, and then uh, she wanted to take a picture, and then he, like, looks at me, and he's like, is it your boyfriend? I was like... No, 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 I, I don't know her. He's like, he's like, he's like, is he the boyfriend? I'm like, no, no, it's not. And then he's like, come on, come on in, come on in. I was like, I was like, dude, so no, I'm, I, it's, it's not my girlfriend. He hasn't done any like, uh, has he? He hasn't done anything else, has he? Since um, they did yeah, that, yeah, he uh, did. He did the the room 2.0 or something. I mean, it was oh, like, did he? Yeah, really? it was like a. Oh, um, I, that. It's okay. I don't know what it was. It was. It's not called the room 2.0, it's called... I, I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah, like hey, you like oh, hello, Mark! Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hey, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. It's been so long. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hi, Mark. Hello, doggy. <laughs> I did that to one of the Criterion developers, you know. I was like, oh, hi, Mark. And he's like, my name's not Mark. I'm like, I know, we're just kidding. Help me see the room. It sucks when some people are, uh, they just don't they get don't, jokes. They don't, they yeah. don't get it, yeah. Yeah, and they're like, it's like it's from the room. Yeah. It's so funny. I don't like, I don't like, uh, uh tight people, you know? Well, he laughed. Okay. <laughs> he laughed when he got it, he started laughing. Alright. <laughs> you know when you, like, make a joke to someone and they just don't get it and they're just like, it's not funny. He wasn't like that. No, he started laughing. He's like, oh. That's good. I feel like the room, a lot of people know it, but a lot of people don't know it at the same time. Yeah, it was definitely, I mean, it blew up big time on the internet at mm -hmm. that time. Mm -hmm. But it kind of faded away quickly, didn't it? Like, no one talks about it anymore. I think he's still got his loyal, his loyal viewers. Yeah, I didn't even know if Room 2.0 came out. Uh, yeah, out. It's, it's like, I don't know, I forgot what it was called, but it was with him and, um... Oh, wait, what's that guy's name? Uh, Sinestro Franco? or something. <laughs> no, 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 not Franco. It, no, his buddy, the guy who he did the, the movie with. Mark. Oh, did they both return? Yeah. <laughs> they need to do, like, gosh, I almost feel like, um, what's his name? You know, the guys who did Seth, is it Seth? Seth Rogen. Seth Rogen and then Franco. Mm. They all need to be in the movie together. 
Yeah. Like the original cast of those guys would be so funny. I don't yeah, know how they would do that, but it's hilarious. I don't know. Do it. Come on. This Y wing. I couldn't get it. I was killed by an AI. No. <laughs> Dang it. We got James Franco. You know. Never seen it, Curtis. It's not for everyone. <laughs> but it's fun. I always remember that part in the room where she says something like, What's clear? I can't remember what the one was. It's up here. Oh, I'm getting shot, dude. Yeah, I'm try to form up on you. I see you. It's like I have no missiles and I can't I recharge or something. I, I don't know I what the hell is going on. My squad, I can select. Super go. weird. There you are. I got you. My radar over. Then that direction. Going in. Firing at these uh. These scum. My wings. Rebel scum. Rebel scum. Do it. Okay, we are defending our beautiful Star Destroyer here. Get him! We got him. Get it down. I should probably form up more on my squad, shouldn't I? Yeah. <laughs> I should probably not die. Okay, I'm right behind you. Firing on enemy, over. It's the way. Yeah, that unit is down. Jeez, Where Louise. is this dude? I have you now. Do it. Do it. Now you won't die. Yeah, that dude's on fire. Oh, I saw <laughs> you. I just passed you. <laughs> I'm heading for the... I'm heading for the uh, flagship, over. Going in. If I die, going down in a ball of glory. Oh god, yeah, I'm dying. They got a lock on me. Try and take down the shields. Ah, oh, bum, bummer. Uh, Time to now we pop the nostrils. You're still having the allergies, or you don't know. Well, my allergies finally went away a little bit. Have they? Yeah, have your allergies been bad? Like, my allergies have been awful. Terrible, man. Oh, yeah. God, I don't know if it's technically allergy season, but I guess it is. Um, they were all summer, like, I'd say July, August, September yeah. was really bad, and then... Good to know I'm not the only one, it's just like... My allergies, man. For real. For real. There was one point where I went to an allergist to get like allergy shots. Yeah. And then I stopped doing that. Because like they were doing these shots, you know? Yeah. And what they do is they have you sit in the waiting room. It's like, go and sit in the waiting room. We want to make sure that you don't have any like severe reactions. Oh no. So I was sitting in the waiting room, you know? And uh, me and my twin bro were getting done at the same time. Mm hmm. And I'm like, oh man, I'm starting not to feel well. And my face started like heating up. What I can't describe you? it. Like just the, sh the shot? It's like a sh just shot, just the shot, just basically allergy shot. Jesus. My face started heating up. You know, I'm like, I hope my bro doesn't notice. You know. Yeah. And then uh, my heart rate started increasing dramatically. Oh no. Like I'm talking like where I was like, oh yeah, crap, I think I'm having a heart attack. Yeah. Wh and then the my bro Robbie looked over at me. He was like. Are you okay? <laughs> I'm like, oh, I don't think so. And I had to get the doctor and everything, you know. And eventually it calmed down, but I stopped doing it at that moment. I was like, I'm done with these allergy shots. Yeah. And yeah. I was like, I'm done. Yeah. I've heard stories too. I've heard other stories where this guy, uh, who was my Uber driver, um, he had his allergy shots done and he had a heart attack right then and there. I was like, jeez, man, that's scary, man. Okay, take down the next wings. I'm gonna try to form up again. I don't think I'm allergic to anything. Story. Be careful of allergy shots. 
you're allergic to everything? No, I, I don't think I'm allergic to anything. Really? Yeah. But if you have allergies, you got it. Um, I think it was my dog. Or maybe hay fever, oh. but I, I, yeah. But look, there's nothing that I'm like, that I know of at least. So are you taking something? No. Uh, okay. No, I just, just, I was living with it. It was like, <clears throat> I was always coughing um, during the summer, I think. Well, I got a husky, oh, yeah. so I, I, I've never had a dog before, so I figure maybe there's, you know, a lot of hair, or my body's adapting to it, so... But it's gone That's now. Super to animals. Again, oh, so really? did you adapt to it and just like... I think so, yeah, I just powered through it. Huh. It was pretty I bad thought about getting a like, dog? Couldn't sleep and... Oh, man, yeah. Yeah, hacking, coughing. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, I, I'm... Very, I wouldn't say I'm like very, very allergic. It depends on, it really depends on the dog. Yeah. Um, or the cat. Like, uh, my family's cat, Ebony. I'm really allergic to her. Like, every time I pet her, I have to wash my hands like immediately. It's kind of ridiculous. I'm allergic to cats. I had a cat for 18 years and, um, yeah, I got allergic to her. And I hate that because you want to, you know, you want to yeah, like snuggle cats. to yeah, him and like, you know, animals. pick him up and. Mm hmm. Like, if I were to pet, like, Ebony, and then touch my eyeball, you know, the results would be pretty bad. <laughs> like, I'd be itching all over, and it would ruin my day. Like, mm -hmm. I've been there. I didn't know what it was for the longest time. Mm -hmm. And my allergist, he did tell me, he was like, you don't have a cat or dog, do you? I hope not. So, I, I learned real quick that I'm allergic to cats and dogs. But I still want to get a dog. I'm debating on getting a dog or not. Yeah, I took Claritin like a couple times and it was fine. So, but I just kind of wanted to tough it out myself. Yeah. Um, I think that was my last game. I got to go make the Vader comic. Okay, awesome, yeah, dude. Yeah, I got to go, I got to go cover that. Um, but I had a lot of fun. Sounds good. Even though I sucked, but I had, I had fun talking <laughs> to you again. I had, it's been years. Yeah, it was a blast, man. Yeah, man, Absolutely. it was great. Thanks um, for playing. Thank you for inviting me and, and letting me play. Um, I'd Likewise, like to play man. again, man. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we could play, like, we could do Battlefront 2. Yeah. Uh, just name the game. We could Co play. Let Cold War? You want to do Cold War later? Oh, yeah, Cold War would be a blast. When Black are you Hawks. doing that? Well, I'm planning on playing that later tonight. Okay. Um, yeah, do you so, want to fire yeah. me a text or, or a tweet or something? Okay, or? absolutely. Okay, cool, absolutely. man. Absolutely. Let's All right. do it. Let's do it, man. All right, buddy. All right, take it Catch easy, you dude. later. Bye. All right, have a good one. Oh, I love those guys. I, last time I saw them, I think, was in Germany. Um, yeah, for Battlefront. It was for Gamescom, which was pretty cool. It was fun. Anyways, uh, thanks for joining me, guys. Sorry, I, you know, I'm not a very good player at this game. I don't, I've played maybe three four times, and uh, it's still a great game. It's fun, um, but very technical. Requires a lot of hours. So I'm going to go make the Vader comic, bring that to life, and explain it for you guys because I haven't done that. Uh, I've been pretty busy the last couple days with some projects that you will see very soon, and I hope you enjoy it. I look for the Vader comics. That's good. Um, the reason why flight mechanics and sounds in space is because space is not a vacuum. It's filled with either like a liquid or plasma. Hope that helps. Thanks, Squirrel Tech. There's also no molecules in space, so there's nothing to bounce off of, right? It's the Disney buying the Vader fan film. They're not doing that yet. I think, don't think they ever will. Thanks for joining me, guys. I will catch you in tomorrow's video. Hope you enjoy it.